Jiggle Morning, my stupid ass. We don't know this in TV. Checking in, man. Um, so tell everybody, um, how did you come up with your name? Sick, you got it. My uh, bitch ass daddy gave me that, that name, Jigger. You know what I mean? Before he didn't stop fucking with a nigga or whatever, but yeah, that's how I get my name. I've been at that name. That ain't no rap shit. That's some family type shit, you know? Like, when did you start making music? I started making music like, fuck. Shit, like everybody else. I'm young, I was like, young, fucking with the shit, writing the shit down. My partners really made me start fucking with that shit. I wasn't doing that shit. Like, they said I got it, you know? They said I'm raw, so I'm raw. You know what I started fucking with this shit. Okay, so growing up, I'm like, who influenced you for to start making music? Shit, gang them, my partners. You know what I mean? That's it. Okay. Also, do you have any projects coming up? Yeah. All the hot stuff. I got a hot mixtape on the way. New videos. You know, all that. Are you got features on that? Nah, I probably got gang on. That's too easy. You know, J Ride has Steedo. Fuck, uh, Shorty Deuce. And, uh, Young True. That's it, gang on. Okay, so tell the people, like, what's the average day like for you? Every street nigga shit, man. That's it. Fuck. So, you know what it is. Um, so, I'm like, what separates you from other artists? Uh, shit, I just, I just spit that shit. That, that real shit when they want help. Hype shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, what I'm going through, when I wake up, what I see, and what I do. Niggas be capping. Okay, so for the people who don't know, I'm like, what has been the best song that you have released so far? And I'm telling why. Shit, I got it uh, All my shit wrong. But fuck, y'all wanna go off the stats and shit. Y'all know that jiggle flow, that shit platinum. That's like a, you know. It was like an anthem? Yeah. Okay, so for your city, do you feel like other artists in your city are like support one another? Shit, I don't know what they do. I don't know, I, don't, I ain't really, I ain't looking for no fucking support from no, no rappers and all that, but fuck, I don't know. If you want some, I don't know. So, um, so do you plan on collaborating with other rappers in your city? Nah, I don't fuck with no rappers, I don't fuck with no rappers. Screw them, man. <laughs> um, tell the people, I'm like, what do you enjoy most, and also what do you hate most about being a music artist? Oh, uh, fuck. A lot of fans, you know what I mean? I appreciate all that, all the love, the fans and shit. I don't really hate nothing though. Fuck, I ain't got nothing to say. You know? I ain't got no hate on that shit. It is what it is. You fuck with me, fuck with me, I fuck with you. You don't fuck with me, you know what it is. Like, I don't got nothing I hate though. Okay. So for your city, do you feel like local DJs and also the, on the radio could do a better job in breaking artist music? Nah, them niggas be bitches, man. All them niggas, Q9, three all them niggas, they put the bend on that shit. Yeah, I'm just, but I ain't chillin', I'm just wait till niggas, you know, join the bandwagon, you know how that shit be. Whatever. Okay, so do you feel like you have to move out your city? I'm like, what's your music career? I'm like, reach a certain milestone? No, nah. You probably, you know, we gonna get into that, we gang gonna, we, we gonna, we gonna explore. Simpson, but nah, I don't feel like that. So has it ever been a point in your music career? I mean, you just wanted to give up? No, nah. I felt bad, cause I wanted to. I was not the business side of the shit. But nah, I ain't never feel like giving up, man, like that. Okay. Um, so how well do you take um, like constructive criticism? Constructive criticism? Fuck. Like what you mean, like when niggas like won't talk, like give like, me a little point of view, yeah, yeah. two cents and shit. Fuck it, yeah, yeah. niggas say what they want. Fuck, I'm just do what the fuck I want to do. Do me. See what I'm saying? Okay, so I'm like, what do you see your music career going? I'm like, three years from now. Nah, uh, shit, Gangnam, we all the way fucking Calabas or something. Cutting out, you know, doing our shit, you know. I think everybody gonna gravitate to my shit by that. 
about three years from now, cause 2020, we about, you know, we on that the whole year. See what I'm saying? Yeah, we dropping everything, man. We ain't holding nothing else. So fuck. Okay. That's why I see myself. See myself with them M's. That bag for real. I was tell your fans, I'm like, what's your most I'm like, memorable concert performance that you had? I'm tell, and I'm telling why. Uh, my little cousin had a little, uh, he throw parties and shit, he go off the Aaron, you hear me? Aaron, the owner. He, uh, he do his little shit, he throw parties and shit. We had some shit outside, you hear me? Fuck, that bitch was packed like a motherfucker or whatever. And fuck, I just got in the middle of the whole, like, you know, it wasn't no stage or nothing. It was just peep everywhere, so I got in the middle of that bitch and rocked that bitch. All the fans, they jump around and shit like, yeah, I really fuck with that one. Like, that was one of them bitches I really remember. Yeah, I saw the video. Yeah, hard oh, shit. Niggas can't do that. Okay. And I'm also, since you're speaking on acting with other artists can't do. Um, So tell them, hey, but how did you make it to a point um, acting where you had, with, um, I think you had like one million um, views on YouTube? Yeah, no cap. Million views, I ain't see a nigga. And that. you barely promoted it. Yeah, no promotion, no cosigns, no fucking, no none of that. Just out with me. I put that shit out, that shit went down, that shit went up. You hear me? Niggas fuck with it, you know? But growing up um, in, on the Scottsdale, um, how did that um, like, impact your music? Shit, man, niggas sing, you know, sing older niggas, you know, gang them, um, doing this shit. Nigga know one day I'm gonna be that day, you know man? So, you know, nah, that shit the same shit, man. Like, I, I, everybody else who grew up in their hood or whatever, like, you know, you see all the, you got the niggas who doing this shit and who not doing this shit. I look up to niggas who doing that shit for real. You see what I'm saying? And shit, niggas saying all that shit, you know how the hood was. Y'all know about the hood. That's how a nigga came up, you see what I'm saying? Okay. Um, so what's your advice um, to a younger artist that's trying to follow on um, your footsteps? Shit, don't find ain't no I ain't no role model now. Don't follow me, but I can say this. Shit, just uh, spit that real shit, you know? What you really going through, man. When you wake up, what you see and what you do, shit, nigga don't gravitate to that, that's, you know? I fuck with it. I don't care you. Shit's or not, it's some real shit. I'm gonna fuck with it, gang. Okay. Okay. So I'm um, like out there. I'm um, like other. I'm um, like business ventures. Um, that you trying to tap into? Yeah, you see my little shit right here. That GT. I'm fucking with that gear shit right now. Getting this shit. Uh, you know, a long time coming. For I been supposed to do this shit, but I'm doing this shit now, nah, nigga. Really, my whole game. We just got out of jail type shit. We back on that type shit. You hear me? So for the um, like GTA movement, um, can you tell people more about it? Yeah, GTA, the G stand for get, the T stand for through, and the A stand for anything, you know, get through anything, you know, nice and simple, you know, we really get through anything, any obstacle in a nigga way, we can't do that shit, and nigga ain't holding us back from nothing, you know, nigga can't stop this, kicking down doors and all that shit, you know, so that's like a little, you know, everybody gravity on your grandma, she probably get through anything. You know, your mama, she gonna get through anything. So that's shit, like worldwide type shit. See what I'm saying? Niggas fuck with that. You know? It's a lifestyle too, ain't nothing else. It's lifestyle. So tell the people, all right, what do you think you'll be doing? I'm like, if you wasn't doing music. Shit, man, I'll be in a trap. Shit. Doing the same shit nigga ain't doing instead of fucking rapping. I fuck. That's it. Okay. So tell the people I'm like, what's next for you? Shit, I see we you know, on big things, you know what I Shit, we gon' we about to get in this industry, keep it, keep it gangsta look. We about to do our shit, drop all these videos. Y'all about to be saying, man, just check the YouTube out, gang. No cap. Okay, and um, last but not least, tell everybody, I'm um, like, what can they find you? And also, I'm um, like, what can they find your music? Man, uh, Jigga Money, type that on anything. Jigga Money on Instagram, YouTube, 
All that shit. I'm about to start updating my shit on the iTunes and shit. I know people be too. It be on my ass. Gang don't be on my ass. Yeah, you put that shit on iTunes and shit, so I'm about to get on all that. Man. I ain't, you know, I ain't playing with it no more. I'm taking the shit serious now. You see what I'm saying? No more playing with this shit.